these are the two fuzzy numbers called A and B and we need to add these two using the alpha cuts principle so the alpha cut principle actually the, the sum of intervals between different cut of alphas and once you added these two using this technique you will get another fuzzy number and we named it as a C so this is the tabular representation for fuzzy number 3 these are the element in the universe of discourse and these are the membership function value so for this one we got 0.7 when the element is 2 so we put this marker in this level okay and in alpha cut technique we need to figure out the intervals for each alpha for example when the alpha is 0.3 what would be the starting and ending point in this case you can see here the alpha is 0.3 in that case the starting point is 1 which means a1 and a2 is uh, 5 in similar way we represent uh, fuzzy number 7 in this tabular representation technique so now we need to uh, calculate each of the alpha cut to get the new number okay so we start from 0.4 you can start from here or you can start from here that is totally up to you so for point 0.4 in fuzzy number 3 we got a1 is 2 and a2 is 4 and for fuzzy number 7 we got b1 is 6 and b2 is 8 and if you just plug these values in this formula so we will get new intervals for alpha cut 0.4 which means 8 to 12 and that's why the new number alpha cut should starts from element 8 and it ends at element 12 so we repeat this process for each of the alpha cut okay so now you can see the alpha cut when 0.5 then you can see these are the starting and these are the ending so you just added these two differences which means this a1 and b1 a1 is 2 and b1 is 6 this one is a1 this one is b1 so the new interval should be a to 12 in similar way you could see the 0.8 alpha cut and there is no interval because it start and starting and ending point at the same position in this case 3 and in this case 7 so we just added these two so the new interval should start from 10 and ends at 10 so you can see this portion is here so once you repeat this all this alpha cards principle so we will get table something like this one and this is the final output.